Hello everyone, today we will learn how to send you Instagram photos via email. So if you are handling an Instagram account and you want your head to be notified with an email about the new post that you have created on your Instagram, then you can create an automation for this purpose. We can do this with the help of Pabli Connect. We are going to create an integration where our trigger will be the new image uploaded on Instagram and our action will be to send a notification mail. Let us learn how to do it. So let us suppose that you want to send your team lead a notification email about the new post that you have just created on your Instagram. So we can create an automation rather than sending the notification email to your head every single time you create a new post. So we can create the post or we can create the automation with the help of Pabli. This is the landing page of Pabli. Let's quickly sign in into our account. And this is the page where you can see all the applications provided by Pabli to you. We are going to use Pabli Connect to create the automation today. Click on access now. Now when you reach the dashboard of Pabli Connect because you're going to create a fresh new workflow. So we will click on this button create workflow on your right side and give a suitable name to your workflow. I am going to name it as send email notifications for new Instagram post. Click on create and then you will be forwarded to this page where you can see a blank workflow. You are given two windows trigger and action. You can add more windows like this to it. Now trigger window is the one where you perform an event over here. Like we are going to post a picture on Instagram that is going to be your trigger. And the action will be to send the notification of an email. So let us choose our trigger application as Instagram. And the event will be a new post. So new media posted in my account. So for that, for Pabli Connect to know if you have posted a new picture, you need to connect your Instagram account to your Pabli Connect. So click on connect and then add new connection. Connect with Instagram and because you already have opened your Instagram like this over here in a separate tab, it will automatically detect and just click on allow to give access to your Instagram account. Now Pabli Connect has access inside your Instagram account. Do not worry, it's 100% safe. Whatever trigger event is given over here, only that much data has to be captured by Pabli Connect. Nothing else, neither less nor more. So now we will click on save and send test request and in the meantime, we will post a picture over here or create a post over here okay click on save and send test request go to instagram and then now we will create a new post click on create select from computer select the picture open it if you want to do any settings next this is a sunflower is the caption that i'm giving and share so now soon it will be shared and this information along with the picture URL, the image URL will be sent to Pabli Connect. So let us go back and see if a response has been captured or not. See, here you can see a response has been captured. So let us see what is the response. See, this is the image. This is the caption. It's a sunflower. And these are two media URL given. See, first is the media URL, which means this URL is for the image and this is the url given to you for the instagram post okay so for now we will save this and move ahead close this trigger window and now we will move ahead with our action application that is going to be gmail and our trigger event will be to send an email click on connect because you have to connect your gmail also so that public connect can give command to gmail to send an email so connect your google account click on allow give access and here it's connected now you have to fill in certain details which are required to fill whenever you compose an email so recipient email address the sender name email subject and email content are the some important ones that you need to fill so the very first important thing is recipient email address that is the destination so you will enter the destination of your head okay so like your team lead email address is this okay this is the email address we entered a static email address over here we did not map it from the previous step why because first of all if you see the response over here in your trigger application there was no email address mentioned secondly you want one specific person to get notified about the new instagram post so you are entering that if you want more people to be added to it you can put a comma and start adding more email address over here or one more thing you can do is to enter that email addresses in cc and bcc 
okay now sender name is instagram handle team okay this is the sender name because if you are a part of the instagram handling team then this is the sender's name now email subject is new post on instagram okay this is the subject now email content is plain or html it's plain now what is the email content first of all you will type dear sir comma and put a slash and n when you put a slash and n whatever you're going to write after n it will appear in the next line okay so slash and n does the work of the enter key on your keyboard so this is a after you put slash and n you have to map the url and the name also so this is the caption you're putting this and please do not forget to put a double quote here and in the end so that it appears okay this was the caption put a comma or you can also put slash and n to also map the link so you have to add media url okay so this you have done and then write slash n and regards okay make sure you completely remember how to use slash n when and where now no file and attachment you are adding over here just click on save and send test request and wait for the response from the action application now you can see it says done first of all and the response status says sent which means it is done now we will save this workflow right here and we will just close this window and now we will go and check the email address where we sent this notification email here you can see instagram handle team is the new mail received when you open it you can see dear sir and the whole message caption is in double quotes and the link over here with regards so this is done which means we were able to send a notification email to your head person now see it's a very easy workflow two step workflow only trigger as an instagram and new media posted in my account is the event then action as gmail and send email make sure you remember to add all the correct information over here also and the correct recipient email address and also fill the fields where required is written over here also do not forget to save your workflows like this this was the whole video i hope this helped not just these applications but you can integrate many other applications using pably connect if you have any issue regarding pably you can email us at support@pably.com at you can ask your queries at forum.pably.com and if you have any doubts regarding our pricing then you can connect us through this given website if you found this video helpful in any way then make sure to share this with your friends and colleagues to make their life easier by creating automations we will meet in the next video till then do not forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel thank you